Now I'm gonna get Wong Wan's towers now. How are you? This one right here is the one in Springfield, Ohio. And in this demolition video, we'll be episodes that it's called it the Enon Wong Wan's Tower. So this tower, it's so it's in Enon, Ohio. And this was an old cement Wong Wan's Tower. It had a a red and white steel tower on top. It was a KG-225, but I was taken down back in 2014, and it was unfortunate. Well, it's taken down because... Because concrete pieces were falling, it was dangerous for people that was with... And that tower has been replaced by this one right here, LED. This tower is... Yeah, these are this Caltopo Long Line Tower Duo. I consider this a duo since we both got this steel tower, a guy tower, guy long lines. And then this little cement tower. So if you use the only the cement tower here, it's beaconless. Yeah, it's constructed in the 40s, but in the 60s, this tower was constructed right here. To replace this one right here. I don't know why it's still here. No, I'm glad it is. I don't know. It's not really a tower anymore. It's just a building. But this tower right here it used to have old school incandescence. But in the 80s, they were removed. So this tower was beaconless. Until like 2011, when this tower, I think it got FH308 or white only dye white LEDs. But in the late 2010s, it got white only FTS 370s. So, yeah, I'll show you Old Street View of it from, I guess, 2009. Back when it was beaconless. This one's in Cable, Ohio. Cable. The street view is from like 2018. See, it has an old school incandescent. Had its horns removed, unfortunately. There's that. This one's in Plain City. Street view, yeah, it was 2021 since the street view is six months ago. It looks beaconless, unless it's an LED. Had its horns removed. This one right here is in Poe Well. It's another guy to Long Lines Tower. It has an FH324 and the horns have been removed. This one's in Alexandria, Ohio. Street U is in 2019. Looks like FH308. 7 years ago, yeah, it was the same. Yeah, Street U is 2014. Probably 2015 now. Since now 2022. Port Washington. Washington, Ohio, eight years ago. So this would be in, like, I say 2012. Or, no, 2013. I'm guessing it has an incandescent. Sugar Creek, Ohio. This tower is sadly beacon with so it might be a KG225. No, it's just beacon with. Not that special. So I said it's a long line tower, part of the whole network. Perrysville. Not any very close street to this tower, but I'm guessing it does have an incandescent. Fredericksburg. 
this is nine years ago, so I think this is like 2012. It has a single strobe, it looks like. Navir, how you pronounce that? <clears throat> You're distracting me from talking about towers. Oh, sorry. Alright, so hey, viewers, my mom distracted me. So, this tower looks like it has a KG225 right here. It's also this cell tower. Lisbon, Ohio. Probably here the vacuum cleaner. Whatever it is. It was either a KG225 or an SS129, or we'll probably an FH301. It looks too small to. Yeah, it's, probably, it's just some kind of strobe. Here, KG225, SS129, or an FH301. Salem, Ohio. This is a cement tower. Over there. Oh. I meant to put these marks in the other account. Can't explain. Showersville, Ohio. Street used 2021. Beaconless. Horns removed. It's now used as a cell tower, it looks like. It might have some hidden single strobe. I bet. Alright, here's a Western Union Tower. Love these conjoined towers. There's that. There's that one right there. This street view was from, say, 2014. This, this cement long lines tower in Brexel, Ohio. I think this is actually the closest long lines tower to YZ in the South. Yes, yeah, 2021. This tower has a pair of markers on top. This monocle is nothing special. It's just boring, beaconless. And I'm going to get this tower back in 2014. But yeah, I can say, I can now tell what year it is since it showed how many years ago it was. And I just guess the year, on, if it's seven years ago, I'll say, I'll say year 2014 or 2015. Twinsburg, Long Lines Tower. Old school incandescence, now use a cell tower. Horns removed. Yep. I oh, see the state borders. I want to the same tower again since there's a lot of towers here. Okay, another Western Union Tower Street View was in 2019. I can't see the beacon. I just think it should have a beacon since there's markers right there. I'm guessing it probably has a single strobe. Kingsville, Ohio. Yeah, this is an interesting one on this tower. I mean, cause that, that top piece up there. This top piece, I don't think it was there until the 90s. And you have this wheel to KG225. That is a cone strobe. I don't know if it's an SS129, a KG225, or an FH301. 
I will just say KG225. KG225 is like the one the most common of the three. Painesville, Ohio. The street used in 2019. Uh, I can't tell what beacon it has, but this thing should have a beacon. I'm guessing it's a single strobe. Ohio, Ohio. This is a cement tower. It has a steel tower on top, which is added on in the 60s. The cement part was constructed in the 40s. The beacon is an old school incandescent. This one's in Birmingham, Ohio. Yep, yeah, there's a town in Ohio called Birmingham. I think it's Street Vision 2021. See the tower there? It also has a steel part added on in the 60s. And, and yeah, also it has an old school incandescent. Like most cement towers. Yeah, it's old school incandescent. Castalia, Ohio. This is another cement tower. Also has a steel part added in the 60s. Then it has an old school nest. And this is now, this is repurposed as a cell tower. So you see cell tower. Let me see what street. Let me just check. 2013. Gibsonville, Ohio. This is another cement tower. 2019. Let's say it's two years ago. In this street, you back in 2007. Two tower. Uh, I think I'm gonna say it probably has a single strobe or LED. I would place an old school in your ass in it. The Bowling Green Orleans Tower. Yeah, I was just making sure this is actually in Ohio. The Bowling Green, Ohio. Street U back from 2009. So Street U from 2019. Rudolph, Ohio. 2013. Appears to have a strobe and incandescent. Old school incandescent and appears to be a strobe. Appears to be a picture of the evening. Horror Ohio. 2013. Old school incandescent. Do has the horn shields. I think that's what those are. It's one of the long line towers in Swanton, Ohio. This is a cement tower. 2019 this is a repurpose of the cell tower. It never got a steel part added on. And it's beaconless, unfortunately. The other long lines tower in Swanton, Ohio. This one, I like this one better than the cement tower. It's a free like a long lines tower, and that's really rare. It's like the one in Horn Lake, Mississippi. So, it has a flash technology dual strobe. If this gets an LED, and it'll be an accomplishment tower. Any markers there? Berkey, Ohio. This is in 2019. Looks like FH308. This 
This tower is next to a state border. It's in Lyons, Ohio. Street used in 2013. Looks like it has an FH308. West Unit, West Unit, Ohio, Long Lines Tower, Street in 2008. Ryan, Ohio, Cement Tower. You can see it over there. I think it had a steel part added on. I don't really know. Seeing if there's any diamonds. I think that's it for our one-one stars in Ohio.